Hey guys, Sludge here. So, I want to go ahead and talk about something real fast. Um, because I saw this post on MORPG.com, Memorpig.com, and uh, it was talking about forced grouping. Now, this is why I have to make this post and this, this video, because I cannot stand the term forced grouping. Okay? And let me tell you why I can't stand the term force grouping. For anyone that doesn't know, let's just go over a general idea of what force grouping, force grouping is to people on the internet, okay? Force grouping is this idea, okay? And I don't know, I don't know where it originates from. I'm, I'm, I'm going to say it just originates from the internet because there is not one game design or document out there ever in existence. I, I guarantee you, if you go look for one, you'll never find a game document ever by a design company that includes the term force grouping under the list of things that they want to include in the game or, or the design focus of the game. But the idea of force grouping is that uh, the content of the game is going to be so group centric, okay, that it's going to force you, and again, let's think about this term for a second, force you. So manipulate what you want to do in the game to the point where you have to group up, okay, to achieve content. Now, why is this such a bad term when we're talking about MMOs? Why is it such a bad term when we're talking about this idea that a game is actually forcing you to play a, to play a certain style, to play this grouping-based style, okay? I'll tell you the main reason why that is. The main reason is that there is never an intention by a developer to force you into grouping. Why is that? Because that's not what it is. The game is never force grouping you it's it's group focused okay that's the thing about mmos is that they're group focused the idea of the content isn't to force you into a group a hundred percent of the time to achieve content okay never in in the history of any game even everquest okay which is classically considered one of the biggest group content and group focus games of all time okay it is not forcing you to group up okay the design of the game itself is not saying you 100 percent have to be in a group or else you're never going to be able to complete anything in this game. The start of the game, okay, I remember when I was playing EverQuest, okay, the start of the game is you would go out into a field, you know, like level one, and you'd be by yourself a lot of the time farming mobs, okay? Now, you could group up at level one, okay, and you could achieve a lot more and a lot faster if you had a group, okay? And that's, that's what the whole idea of it is. And later on, as, as MMOs evolved, okay, this idea came of having a solo class, okay? A class that was a jack-of-all-trades and was tough enough to the point where they could actually uh, complete content, okay, on their own. Now, this is a play style, okay, which, which again, is a design decision, okay? If you want to have a game where you can solo throughout the entire game, okay, that's fine, all right? You can go ahead, you can make that, all right? But the point is, is that group forcing you, group forcing you into a group, okay? It, it's, it's, it's like a nothing term. <laughs> it's, it means nothing, because the whole idea is that they're not trying to force you into the group. The idea is that they want you to collaborate, to cooperate with other people, so that you can achieve a goal, okay? They're not... They're not, there's not some manipulation mechanic here. The people that believe that they're being forced into a group are people that would not want to play these games anyway. That's the, that's the main core thing that I have to get through with this post, okay? Is that there's some idea, there's some fucking idea on the internet, okay, where people think that because a game is, is, is making you group up for certain content, that they're forcing it on you. Oh man, I can't believe that I have to group up to finish this dungeon. Oh man, this sucks. I should just be able to solo it. That's stupid. I'm going to go on the forums and complain about it. That's the type of mentality that leads to the term force grouping. Is this idea that a game has to fit a playstyle for everyone, okay? That is not true. That's not how it fucking works. You you don't you don't just get to say because I don't like grouping up that the game is forcing me to do it. No, that's it's the design of the developers. The developers are making a game Game to be group centric, to be group focused, because that's what they are envisioning. That's what they're designing the game for. Okay, there's no one forcing you to buy that game. Like that's the thing. If you don't want to play games that are group centric, that are group focused, okay, don't buy them. 
don't complain about it because they're going to still be there, okay? It, it's not something that you can do to just say that every game has to include 100% solo capabilities. And that's that's a lie that has been perpetuated for years with MMOs. Is that this there's this idea that floats around everyone's head nowadays where they think, "Oh man, if the game doesn't allow me to just group or to just solo the content from the start and forces me to group up, then it's not worth playing." And and it, and it doesn't make any sense because that's not that's forcing developers into this like cuckold position where they have to watch the players solo through all the content okay and just and just glorify them cheer them on and then when anything hard or, or difficult ever comes about they have to go okay yep you, you, you get a free pass they have to whimper in the corner okay and just let the let the players steamroll throughout their entire game without any challenge whatsoever okay and it's it, it's sad, okay? This is the sad state of games that we're in today, is this idea that this that this uh, majority on the internet, okay, can manipulate an entire industry, an entire group of developers into making their game into solo-centric games and not group-centric, okay? And that's what it really comes down to. It comes to, it's, it, you know what the forcing really is? The forcing is these people that want only solo capabilities in their games. That's actually forcing something. Forcing you to group is not happening because the games that are group-centric aren't, aren't designed for solo players, okay? They're designed for you to solo a bit. They're designed for you to solo through parts of them. That's okay. That's acceptable. There should be content that you can solo, but they sh there, there's no forcing you to play these games that have group-centric content, okay? Just remove that idea from your head because it's not true. It does, it, it's not ever going to be true, okay? It's just it's something that people have said for a long time, and just and it's this term that I've just grown to hate just completely with all of my being because it's never it's never been discussed like i guarantee you if you went up to every game developer okay every mmo developer over the last 10 years and and spilled through all their game design documents there's not going to be one thing in those documents that's going to say the term force grouping it's never going it's 100% of the time Never is it going to be inside any of those documents because it's not real. It's a fabrication. It's this idea that every game, every MMO that exists has to fit an everybody playstyle. It, it always has to be for everyone because because WoW did it, because WoW said, hey, you can solo through a lot of the content. And again, and again, using the WoW example is actually also terrible because in WoW originally, you could definitely not solo through all the content. In original WoW, vanilla wow grouping up was extremely fun and it was extremely group centric at the start of the game it never it never forced you it never forced you into grouping it just said hey here you go if you want to group up you get through the content faster and that's the thing you can have a medium you can have a a game where there is tons of solo content and there's tons of group group content and you can merge those two together okay but that's not what we see anymore okay we see these these almost derogatory terms like force grouping and and everything else that just make the player say oh no if i'm not being able to solo 100 percent of the time i'm being forced into doing something that i don't want to do that's the idea that it comes down to 100 percent of the time is this idea that if i can't do exactly what i want to do as any player if if every single player is not included then it's then then it, it's excluding us okay it has to be all inclusive or it's it's not or it's or it's it's a it's a group it's a group for it's forcing us to group all the time oh man i can't believe i have to group up with the game i can't believe that there's challenges that i cannot face on my own and that i actually have to go out of my bubble i have to go out of my little little fucking reach that i have socially and actually try and get other people to come with me and and cooperate do do some some uh, interpersonal cooperation and actually finish something okay and that's why i had to make this post okay it's a complete rant i know it sounds like a complete rant but it's 100 percent true force grouping is not real it needs to be stricken from the record completely it needs to not exist anymore because too many people have been throwing on this term for too long and i'm and i'm just sick of it i'm sick of hearing it because not every game is going to be all inclusive not every game is going to be designed from the start to fit only solo players or only group players all right it's it's it, whatever the game whatever the designers feel if the designers feel the game should be group centered or group focused okay they're not forcing you into the group okay they're for, you, you're buying into their game okay if you don't want to purchase the game and you want to spend money on it don't do it you know right right come on right
But 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 if you but if you do if you do buy the game, don't bitch and moan that there's that there's too much group content and that it's forcing you to do anything. Okay, guys. So that's it. That that's it for my for my little spiel on force grouping. But I had to make a I had to make a post about it because I'm just like I said I'm just sick of seeing that term floating around on on you know mrpg.com on the forums and on other forums too because it happens all the time and it needs to stop. So. Anyway, guys, that's it for me tonight. I'm going to go play some Fallout 4, man. I'm going to go have some fun. So, anyway, you guys have a good night, man.